Smartphones are convenient, but the small size of their screens can make text input tricky. Tiny keyboards work for some people, but handwriting works for everyone. The WritePad keyboard for Android brings cutting-edge handwriting recognition to your Android smartphone or tablet, and it works great. Setting up WritePad is easy. Once you've installed it, follow the wizard to enable it for input, then press the back button. The next screen gives you the option to make WritePad your default input method, then brings you to the WritePad tutorial to get you acquainted with its features. You'll learn a lot by reading this screen. Once you've installed WritePad, simply write on the screen. WritePad's advanced handwriting recognition system will convert your writing into text. Write one or two words at a time and actually watch the recognition as you go. To change a recognized word, just tap on it to see other options. If you're using a smartphone, landscape mode gives you more room for long words. Tablet users will be comfortable using WritePad in either portrait or landscape orientation. After writing, press the return button to insert the recognized text, or tap back to remove a stroke or fix an error. If you have more than a word or two to write, just jump back to before the marker in the handwriting panel and keep writing. WritePad will recognize your previous text and let you continue writing for as long as you'd like. To adjust the position of the marker, tap and hold it, then drag left or right. The main controls for the keyboard are right here above the handwriting panel. The blank key will clear the panel, or insert a space if it's already empty. When there's no writing in the handwriting panel, you can access a regular keyboard by tapping the keyboard key. This makes it easier to enter complex punctuation or to write words with non-standard spellings. Just tap it again to go back to WritePad's handwriting input. The next key lets you toggle the recognition engine between separate letters mode and a mixed mode that allows both separate and connected writing. It's best to leave the keyboard in mixed mode unless you never write in cursive. It'll figure out your writing as long as you write whole words. WritePad uses a custom dictionary in the recognition process, so it needs whole words to accurately convert your handwriting. This button toggles between caps lock, number input, and a symbol aware mode that makes writing email addresses and website addresses easy. And the gear button brings you into the keyboard settings. Here, you can make adjustments to the way WritePad works. Auto Learner turns the intelligent learning feature on and off. Auto Corrector toggles a built-in spelling corrector, and Auto Insert Results lets WritePad automatically add the recognized text to your document. These three settings are on by default. To add or remove words from the Auto Corrector, tap Edit Auto Corrector Lists, then tap the plus to add a word, or the menu key to delete entries. If you want to add words to WritePad's custom dictionary, tap Edit User Dictionary. This section works just like the autocorrector area and lets you make sure WritePad always recognizes unusual words that are important to you. If you want to change the look of the handwriting panel, use the handwriting panel settings section to adjust the colors, hide the guidelines, and change the color and thickness of the digital ink input. You can really customize things to fit your needs. Play around with WritePad. Try using text input to search for an address in the Maps app. Handwrite a tweet. You can even use a stylus to write naturally on the screen. WritePad adds powerful handwriting recognition to Android's robust voice recognition and keyboard inputs, turning your smartphone into a device that you can truly interact with however you'd like.